Yeah, yeah, what? Now, once upon a time, they used to allow truck parking here. But then the drivers left their garbage, they left their trash, and they didn't respect the property. So now they got these signs up all over the place. Good job, boys. Good job. Slobs. Hey everybody, how's it going? Hope all's well on your side of the screen. Things are pretty good here. It's Tuesday, and I'm all done for today, so this is going to be a two for Tuesday vlog update or something like that. So let's start off with Monday, yesterday. I did a uh, my usual northbound run, uh, except this time I had a 5 a.m. delivery in Messina, and then that followed up with a delivery in Potsdam. Both of those went relatively smoothly. And then I brought the empty down to Salve, picked up a load, which I brought back over here to the yard, dropped, and went home. That was my day. Then I went and got something to eat up here at the nice and sleazy. Got a couple slices of pizza and a soda pop. Went home and had a couple minutes of stress relief. And the final stop of the day, home with some stress relief. And then after that little moment of stress relief, I went and I took a nap and uh, had to be back at the yard around 2 o'clock in the morning because I was told to be here at 2 to take a load from the yard down to HQ to be to pick up a yard to be in Auburn by 8 a.m., which I've done before and I usually cut it close, but I've been able to do it. Well, I get to the yard this morning at 1.45. I think I get myself a little ahead of the game. And I was told I had to go pick up a load in Baldwinsville, which is uh, roughly about a 25, 30 minute drive from the yard here. So I went and picked up the load in Baldwinsville and took that down to HQ. And instead of getting down to HQ at 4.30 like I should have, I didn't get down there until 6 a.m. So that put me about an hour and a half behind schedule. Well, I roll out of the inspection bay and I was still in the old 2002 Mac. And what do I see? I see the old hag here sitting in line. Back from the dealership. So I dropped the trailer and went and talked to the mechanics and said, Hey, is she done? They said, Yep, all fixed. So I got my truck back today, which is awesome. Now, they didn't fix the bumper, which is what I thought they were making the big deal about last week. But the power issue I was having where it was spitting and sputtering and losing power is no more. Uh, it's running like an animal. A lot of power, a lot of oomph. And uh, I've been here since November and I've been driving this truck and I've never had this much power with this truck. This truck has never run this good. And I believe they also replaced the uh, cab mounts, the airbags underneath the cab because the cab's sitting up a little bit higher and it's riding a whole lot smoother, which I'm okay with. My back doesn't hurt as much today. So I got the old hag here back, and uh, I'm all done my day. 
Um, after I left HQ, I went up to Auburn and uh, sat there for three and a half hours while they unloaded the trailer. And then by the time I got done there and back to the yard here, I only have an hour left on my clock. And now I've got to go home so I can eat, sleep, take another nap, and be back at the yard by 1 a.m. Not really a big fan of this schedule, and I'm not really a big fan of what they've got me doing. But uh, it is what it is. You know, I just do what I'm told. Go where they tell me, and uh, I just kind of roll with it. Don't really complain or bitch about it. Just do what's expected me of, to do. I don't always like what I'm doing, but hey, sometimes you get good, you know, loads, and sometimes you get stuff that you don't want to do, which is what I seem to be doing this week. But uh, that's all for now. I'm gonna make like a fetus and head out. I'll talk to y'all later. Y'all have a good day. Eh?